Good morning, good afternoon and good evening everyone. So today I got Redmi Note 12 4G and I have installed the Hyper OS, the Lite Edition, right? This ROM comes with the Android version 14. Now the special things about this ROM that it have a Mi Dialer. We can record calls with the Mi Dialer. It have a Mi SMS application. Those who like to have a Mi Dialer and Mi SMS application, they will like this Hyper OS Lite Edition ROM. Well, you know that the stock ROM Hyper OS not not providing the control center with blur so this rom is providing blur control center and definitely you're gonna like it and the bouncing folder looking awesome and also the animations that are not coming with the stock rom we are getting the animations with the with this rom like uh, opening and closing any application we will get the animation over here so there are a few things provided uh, on the home screen settings like uh, bounce uh, while opening folder bounce while closing folder blur in, uh, blur in open folder center title or open folder etc etc which are not uh, available on the stock rom the fingerprint scanner is working the face unlocking is properly working with a good speed and this rom is coming with a purchased version of the widgets there are many many widgets available with this rom and all are purchased version like if you go and tap any widget you will see that all the widgets are purchased you can set any widget you like yes we can see the chinese language with the widgets but uh, as far the widget is looking good i will say go for it the camera application provided in this rom is the hyper os camera and uh, all the modes are working perfectly i have checked the modes and uh, no error found with the modes the rear camera and the front camera perfectly working these are the pictures and videos taken by me when with this rom so the incoming calls outgoing calls incoming sms outgoing sms properly working 4g network working properly and all the rest thing like wireless connectivity working this rom is for the daily use if you want to have this rom on your mobile phone you need to unlock the bootloader of your mobile phone now this rom is not coming by default device certified so we have to root the rom and we need to make the device certified falsely the customization of the lock screen yes it is provided with the rom we can customize the lock screen the way we like properly working with the rom so definitely i will see that this is the light edition of the hyper os for the redmi note 12 4g and those who liked the animations the blur control center and uh, bouncing folder etc etc they will definitely will go for this rom how to flash this rom you need to watch the further video and uh, do not forget to like the video do not forget to subscribe my channel do, uh, and uh, click or tap the bell icon click or tap the select all thank you so much you need to unlock the boot loader if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader of your mobile phone the provide tutorial video link is provided in my video description watch that video unlock the bootloader and uh, follow the further step you will get this rom on your mobile phone and one more thing as far as you are using this ported rom the bootloader will remain be unlocked watch the video and enjoy the rom so the mobile phone must be on the stock hyper os rom like if the set is updated once to hyper os android 14 then you can flash this rom whatever hyper os version you have on your mobile phone doesn't matter but the mobile the matter is the mobile phone must be on hyper os android 14 rom you need to save all the internal storage data this procedure will format everything and you need to check the battery it should be charged to like maximum must go to the fingerprint print screen lock and turn off the screen lock and in case you are using a xiaomi account and must remove it before applying this rom on the mobile phone sync your google account once and then must remove it and in case if you have done all these things and you can simply power off the mobile phone now let me inform you that this rom is coming with the orange fox recovery after flashing the rom the orange fox recovery will auto flash so links are provided in my video description we need to download the hyper os light for the redmi note 12 the routing application matches the play integrity fix module file and after downloading all these files first of all just extract the rom file in same folder and when it is done then simply open the extracted folder of the rom file and you will see a bunch of files over here mobile phone must be power off mobile phone must be having an unlock bootloader 
you need to check the other side of the cable must be connected with the computer and uh, now boot the mobile phone into fast boot mode press and hold the volume down key connect the cable with the mobile phone in few seconds you will see a fast boot screen and leave the release the volume down key the set is connected with the computer and boot it into fast boot mode come to the computer screen simply double click the windows fast boot first install with the data format batch file double click here the command window will open press y then press enter key and the flashing will get started it will take a little time we have to wait So when flashing gets completed, the mobile phone will auto restart. So we have to boot the mobile phone into Orange Fox recovery that coming with the ROM will get auto flash. Mobile phone gets rebooted. Press and hold the volume up key before me logo appears and hold it press just for a few seconds. The Orange Fox recovery will appear. We finally we got the recovery release the volume up key now wait and the internal storage must be encrypted so tap the third menu first then tap the format data and type y e s tap here then go back to main screen tap the last menu tap reboot and tap recovery Finally, the recovery screen appears once again on the mobile phone and still the storage is not properly decrypted. The internal storage appears on the computer screen, but the internal storage showing not a proper form. Now we have to do one more thing and that is tap the upper arrow, then tap the data folder to open the data folder then tap three dots here and tap create folder and type name M E D I A create a media folder over here tap here and then go to the last menu then tap mount and disable the mtp once and then re-enable the mtp the internal storage will appear once again with the proper form now we'll go to downloaded folder and i will copy the magis root file and the play integrity fix file let me copy just the magis file only and I will paste this magis file to the internal storage of the mobile phone and then come to the mobile phone screen come to the first menu then tap the media folder and select the magis file to flash it done then tap reboot system the mobile phone will be waiting on this me logo and then we'll start booting to the hyper os Lite edition the first boot will take a little time we have to wait So finally the first boot completed and uh, take a little long time so complete the setup screen now after completing the setup screen you will see these widgets you can just remove the widget from the desktop screen and then we'll go to settings and finally we got the hyper os light edition 1.0.2 and white version 14 now we'll have to make the device certified so the cable is connected i will make a change here from the notification center so i got the internal storage on my computer screen we'll go to my downloaded folder and we'll copy the play integrity fix file and the mages file both files i will copy from here and i will go to my internal storage of the mobile phone and i will, I will paste that both files on the internal storage so done disconnect the cable from the mobile phone and we are done from the computer come to the mobile phone screen open the file manager and then install the magis file first give a permission turn tap open allow all time tap ok to reboot the mobile phone unlocking the screen and i will go to menu tap to open the magis application once again then tap cancel on this window if uh, this window pop-ups every time when opening the magis application now tap 
uh, the setting first scroll down turn on this digest uh, option and then go back tap modules tap install from storage and tap recent select the redmi note 12 change the view scroll down select play integrity fix file and tap ok to let install it and then tap reboot now uh, open the magis application once again to check the things are okay tap cancel go to modules you must see the play integrity fix file like this it does not have any red lines and it must be turned on so all the things done perfectly now simply log in your gmail account and then go to settings after after uh, adding your gmail account then go to apps and uh, tap manage apps tap the three dots show all apps search for PLY first select the Google Play Store then tap clear data clear all data ok go back select play services clear all data manage space clear all data delete done and finally all things done very perfectly enjoy the ROM the device will get certified the safety net will get passed do not forget to like the video and to keep watching the video subscribe my channel we we'll see you in my next video until then goodbye